Greetings to all of you. I'm Richard Wing, and this is what we call Three Good Minutes, moments hopefully for inspiration for the living of these days. I want to tell you about a woman whose name is Mrs. de Graffenreid. Here's the story. She turned to her husband one morning in their small house and asked him to put the cat out. And as he stepped outside, there was a man by the name of Riley Arsenault who came forward with a gun and said, don't make me kill you. Let's go in the house. And they did. And he was threatening both of them. And Mrs. de Graffenreid came forward and said, uh, young man, I'm a Christian lady. I don't believe in no violence. Put that gun down and you sit down. I don't allow no violence here. The guy, Riley, obviously, surprised, sat down, put the gun down. And she turned to Nathan and said, you get him some socks and I'm going to fix him a breakfast. And so she did. And they sat down. And then after that breakfast, she said, young man, I love you and God loves you. God loves you and all of us, every one of us, especially you. Jesus would die for you because he loves you so much. And Riley started to cry. He said, you sound like my grandma. She's dead. About that time, the police cars started to come. They're going to kill me. They're going to kill me. She says, no, they're not. Police surrounded the, the house. Mrs. DeGraff and Reed confronted the police. You all put those guns back in your holsters. I don't allow no violence here. Riley wants to come on out and he's going to come out in a minute. But first of all, you got to put your guns away. Now do it. And they put their guns away. And she turned and said, Nathan, now you bring him on out. And he came out. Police put the cuffs on him and they took him away. The other two convicts who escaped with Riley Arsenault entered a backyard. A man went inside for a gun, came out, and they shot him dead. And his wife was taken as a hostage. Nathan and Louise de Graffenreid belong to the Primitive Baptist Church, where oftentimes they sing a verse from, Are ye able? Are you able, said the master, when a thief lifts up his eyes, to know that his pardoned soul is worthy of a place in paradise. Lord, we are able. Mrs. de Graffenried is probably the best example of the radical love that we see in Jesus Christ, most especially written in the Beatitudes. This is Three Good Minutes. I'm Richard Wing, wishing you all the best.